Welcome to Monday Night Raw. Last week we learned what the fate of Barrett, Regal, McIntyre, and Sheamus would be after their collusion at bragging rights. That's right. In three weeks, those men will get just what they deserve in that huge eight-man tag match at Survivor Series. The outcome of which couldn't be any greater. We've been told that the team that wins at Survivor Series will be considered number one contenders for every title in WWE. And right now, we're set to see two of the participants in that Survivor Series match square off. So Sheamus and Alberto Del Rio will continue where they left off last week. Oh, and Sheamus hopes they don't actually continue from there. I mean, the last time we saw him, Del Rio's Survivor Series partner, Edge, speared Sheamus right into a crate. Del Rio answers back. Del Rio. Del Rio took all of that. Oh, look out! Oh, man! He landed right on his neck from that German suplex. Intercepted. Coming. Watch out here. When you look back at Bragging Rights, King, I can't help but wonder if Team SmackDown sealed their own fate by the way they treated Wade Barrett. Well, I don't think so. I mean, Wade Barrett loves to be in the middle of controversy. We saw it with Nexus, and we're seeing it again. Uh-oh. Sneak up. the spine and back. We talk about Sheamus' strength, but how about his smarts? Yeah, I'll be the first to admit, this guy's good. Cena and his World Heavyweight Championship. He's been after that for months. Wait a minute. And now, Sheamus, the Irish Curse Backbreaker. My goodness. Sheamus is just so hard to stop. Cover here. One, One two, two, three. three. Sheamus wins. Gets some measure of revenge after being beaten down last night. Right. Tonight it's Del Rio that's going to bed early. And more importantly, it's Sheamus that builds momentum for his team at Survivor Series.